This is just your daily reminder that collecting huge amounts of data and storing that in the cloud can lead to massive data breaches. Here's an example, EY or Ernst & Young, the big accounting firm, exposed four terabytes, not gigabytes, terabytes of SQL database information to the open internet for who knows how long. This is from the register, the big four businesses, big fat fail exposed a boatload of secrets online. The cybersecurity firm from the Netherlands reported how they found this information and how their lead researcher discovered this four terabytes of data stored on the internet, which included API keys, cached authentication tokens, session tokens, service account passwords, and user credentials. Neo Security's write-up about this goes into it in a lot of detail, if you're interested, where the researcher found this information and the security researcher was very surprised with the amount of information exposed on the open internet, which included all of this confidential information. They said that finding a four terabyte SQL backup exposed to the public public internet is like finding the master blueprint and the physical keys to a vault just sitting there with a note that says free to a good home. So this is the problem. Companies are putting information in the cloud and this became exposed via a classic cloud bucket misconfiguration. The security shop warned about the fact that it's very easy now to back up your database on the internet. So that's great, but it's very dangerous because one wrong click, one typo in a bucket name, and suddenly your private data is sitting in a public bucket. It's that easy to accidentally leak terabytes of sensitive data. So again, this is just another warning about using the cloud and putting your data in the cloud. But what are your thoughts about this? This is one of the so-called trusted top four accounting firms out there, and they leaked this huge amount of data onto the internet. But what are your thoughts? To me, this is just another day of data breaches and confidential data being leaked onto the internet. Fortunately for Ernst & Young in this case, or EY as it's called these days, a ethical hacker or cybersecurity researcher found this data, but who knows if someone else already has access to this data. Some black hat hacker may have already got all of this from this exposed SQL database. Just another warning again about collecting huge amounts of data and putting it online.